Hi everyone. Uh, this is the Math 10C Exponents and Radicals review. This is multiple choice question 21. Evaluate 125 over 8 to the negative 2 thirds. Okay, well, I, I honestly, I think the first thing we want to do is deal with that negative. Okay, because we know what the negative does. It causes a reciprocal. So what's going to happen here, this is going to quickly become just 8 over 125 to the 2 thirds. Now, notice that that negative does not reciprocate the exponent. It's just the base of the power that gets reciprocated. That's it. Okay? Don't don't make this out to be more difficult than it is. Okay? A lot of times people will struggle with this, but in reality it's because they're they're assuming that there's way more involved with it. You just reciprocate the base. Now, I got two things going on here. I'm squaring the base and I'm cube rooting the base. And I got to do both of those. Doesn't matter what order I do it in. And that's not exactly true. You want to do the cube root first. Okay? The order Technically doesn't matter, but it's far easier to do the cube root of 8 over 125 squared. Okay, because the cube root, well, 8 is going to be 2 times 2 times 2, and 125 is 5 times 5 times 5. Okay, so with a cube root, and sorry, and this is all going to be squared here. So with a cube root, I'm taking out a 2, and I'm taking out a 5 out of the denominator. So I'm going to be left with, well, here, I'll, I'll write this over here. This is going to become... 2 over 5, those are the cube roots, but I still have that square there. So 2 over 5 squared, well 2 squared is 4, 5 squared is 25, so my answer has got to be 4 over 25, and the answer is A.